Okay, so you've been wondering why uh, we're so excited about this um, ProRes. So on the latest Fermit Pro, okay, we have ta -da, the ProRes. As you can see that in ProRes, Proxy, it records at 770 megabits per second, all the way to ProRes 422 HQ at 735 megabits per second, easily five to six times more. So I've just tested it and one minute footage can easily take over four to five gigs of space at 4K, 30 frames per second. Okay, that's the max uh, that you can record in Flamic Pro. I tested on my iPhone 13 Pro uh, Max. And so to see a difference, I thought I'll do a recording using the video. Okay, now this is video and uh one x because he has of course the sensor sh uh sensor shift and you can see bottom bottom right corner is at 4k 60 hertz per second so i'm going to just match it 4k at 30 hertz per second okay so this is a lighter i'm recording in a pretty dim room okay not pitch dark because i should woke up so it's not there's lights coming off so you can see the difference okay so i'm sure you can see Okay, maybe I should try. Ooh, hold on. Let me try macro. Okay, so I'm going to record maybe macro. I don't burn down my house down. Okay, as you can see, there's still details. Okay, in a low light with extreme light here. Okay, so let's. Uh, I'm going to record first. Or we'll go to one X first, okay, and record. Okay, I'm gonna record ten second footage and then compare size as well as quality with this lighter. Oh, that's ten seconds. Sorry, that's about eleven seconds. Oops. Okay, next, let's go to Flamic Pro. Yeah, look at that. I mix it up. So in top left hand corner, I can see ProRes. Top right is in. Uh, high quality. So how do I know? Go to resolution. You can see it's 4K. Okay. Uh, 422 HQ. Okay. You can see that all the different 422 variants. So now it's 422 HQ. You can see you can record left over of 80 minutes left. If at the lowest is like 320 minutes and 160, 107 and then 80 minutes. Okay. If you look at the top right hand corner. And of course this ProRes. Of course it has 10 bit. As you can see. Okay. Great for a lot. Version 3. But eight bit and of course ProRes and of course there's a Dolby Vision HDR, okay. For mm, me extreme, but ProRes different, okay. The bit rate, bit rate, bit rate, is amazing and says it's great out. The HEVC, okay. We shall see the format. Same thing. I'm going to record in um. Okay, I can just focus on the same thing. Okay, in HQ. Okay, four to two with the lighter. Okay, for one uh, 10 second, let's go. All right, look at that. Oh my God. Seems that like the lighter part may have a bit more detail. Okay, that's it. Okay, I recorded 12 seconds there. A little bit more, a few seconds won't die. Okay, <laughs> actually it does, it does. Okay, anyway, so let's compare. We are going to the photos app. And this is the two footage, I believe. There you go. First one, okay, HDR. I'm gonna swipe up, you can see the details, okay. It's a 4K, okay, Dolby Vision, HEVC, 30 frames per second for about 12 seconds. Look at that. It is 63.8 megabyte. Okay, let's go over to the next one. This is by Flamby Pro, and this is ProRes HQ. We can see actually there's a bit more detail. At least to me, it felt like there's more detail. And it's 30 frames, 4K, 14 seconds, okay? But it's 852. 852.7. So 63 versus 800, okay? It's definitely 10 times more at least, okay? So uh, again, there's two more seconds, but yes, yeah, you can see it's about 10 times more. <laughs> in terms of outside, just like Pro Raw in photo as well, okay? So check it out. Woo!